friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name is Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW or the Weight Watchers Blue Plan. Happy Saturday, it's Saturday, it's grocery haul day. I shopped at four stores four stores, three because that's what I chose to do and one because I had no other choice. It seems like we are running out of products pretty much everywhere and I'm having a hard time finding the items that I need for recipes. So let me know down in the comments if you're struggling in your area to have products in stock. So I ended up going to several stores this week. I have a good grocery haul for you. So if you're excited, give this video a big thumbs up. If you're new or you haven't yet subscribed to my channel, I would love to have you here. Hit the subscribe button and click the bell right next to it so you never miss a single video. We do grocery hauls every single Saturday. Check out that description box down below for my three recipe ebooks. I just released almost one week ago my dinner ebook, which is amazing. You guys are absolutely loving it. It is out. It is here along with breakfast and lunch. All three recipe ebooks contain 50 recipes, all WW plan points included, as well as calories. So highly recommend make your life easy with breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and stay tuned for the fourth and final ebook coming out shortly. You're also going to find nutrition coaching where I offer personalized to you macros and calories. Highly, highly recommend. That way you know where you should fall every day to reach your goals. You're also going to find one-on-one -on -one coaching if you want to talk with me directly. Links, discounts to all my favorite things. And of course, head on over, join us on Facebook. That group is down in the description box as well. So let's jump into this four-store grocery haul. So I went ahead and stopped by my local natural grocers again to stock up on some of my favorite things. One of my favorite kombuchas was on sale and I have a couple new food finds that I want to share with you. So before we do the rest of our grocery haul for the week, let's take a look at what I picked up from natural grocers. First, I grabbed my favorite LaCroix. This is the Lemoncello. This one is so good. And I noticed that Walmart is out of a lot of things. I actually had to shop at a different grocery store this week because they didn't have the majority of what was on my list, which again, I don't really know what's going on, but since they had it and it was on sale at natural grocers, I picked it up. I also grabbed one of the Amy's burritos and cheddar cheese. These are really, really good. Nice to have on hand. They have really, really nice clean ingredients. You know that I love good culture and I have never seen the strawberry chia cottage cheese before. So I was really excited to see this. Organic, it has chia seeds and strawberries. Really excited for this. I only picked one up because I hadn't tried it before. I wanted to make sure that I liked it. I restocked on my Tony's Choco Lonelli's. You can see that these are open. I did bring a couple to my real estate office to give to our front desk girl. I've been raving about them and I wanted her to try them. This is the size of them. So they're pretty small. Like I said, about the size of a quarter, but they are some of the best chocolate and they're really, really good ingredients. Speaking of chocolate, while I was there, and let me tell you, they were almost sold out of these. So I had to grab some more. This is my favorite Choco Love Bites and Pumpkin Spice. I went ahead and picked up three more bags. Also, they have the Peppermint Mocha Creamer from Califia Farms. This is the Almond Milk Creamer. It is only 15 calories per tablespoon. I was really excited to try this. There's no carrageenan in it. I did check for that. It's a seasonal flavor and I'm here for all the pumpkin and peppermint mocha. So I picked that up. And like I said, Health Aid Kombucha was on sale for $1.99. That is the cheapest I have ever seen it. So I stocked up. I did grab one of the grape vibes. I've never tried this flavor. And one of the pomegranate. This one is really good. The bubbly rose, which is delicious. The pink lady apple. Passion fruit tangerine. Grapefruit, which I really, really like. Cherry berry, which I've never tried. And lastly, tropical punch, which is also very delicious. So that is everything that I picked up at Natural Grocers. I'm excited to have some of my favorite things on hand again. And now let's jump into the rest of the grocery haul. And here's the rest of this week's grocery haul. I did Fred Meyer grocery pickup or Kroger because my Walmart was out of everything. And in fact, Kroger was out of two of the things I need for meal prep. So I'm going to have to stop by a third store, but I did go ahead and pick up a few things from each store. So let's jump into the rest of the grocery haul. First, a 24 pack of Diet Coke for Troy. 
You already know, if you watch my channel, he gets a case of Diet Coke every week. He also wanted some more Frito scoops for his Dean's French onion dip. He's going to have a turkey and Colby Jack cheese sandwiches for his lunches. So I picked up the private selection, which is the fancier store brand of Kroger or Fred Meyer, and this is their rustic white bread. Some light mayonnaise for meal prep recipe, and then we just like to have this on hand for a lighter version. Can of organic pumpkin puree. This is for my meal prep this next week. Healthy request cream of mushroom soup. I need this for a dinner recipe. White chocolate chips. This is for our little get together for Halloween. We're having some friends over on the 29th for a Halloween themed dinner. It's going to be so much fun, and I needed white chocolate chocolate chips for that and I thought while I was ordering I would add these ones to my cart because again this is a really good store brand. I needed Gruyere cheese for a dinner recipe and I couldn't find just shredded Gruyere so I grabbed this Alpine blend. It has Swiss and Gruyere. I thought that was close enough for the dinner recipe. Light shredded cheese, just the Mexican style blend for a few recipes this next week. We jack cheese slices for Troy's turkey sandwiches. Since I was ordering from Fred Meyer Kroger, I picked up their private selection center cut bacon. This is my favorite center cut bacon and it's only one point for two slices. So it's the lowest point bacon and it's so, so good. So I picked that up. I'm just going to pop it in my freezer. A small little container of the 0% fa a yogurt for a recipe. Tis the season. I had to grab the natural bliss pumpkin spice creamer. I really like this one. It has better ingredients and it's really, really good. And so I had to grab the pumpkin spice since I was doing my order at Kroger. Walmart doesn't have the best creamer selection, at least my Walmart. Kroger and Target have a much, much better selection. So I had to pick this up. Whole milk for a couple of dinner recipes. Silk almond milk for smoothies. And then I also needed almond milk for a recipe. Lots of turkey. I grabbed the private selection wildflower honey turkey from Fred Meyer. I thought I removed this from my cart. I grabbed two pounds of the turkey from Walmart. So we have turkey coming out of our ears. I'll have some turkey sandwiches this next week as well. A few produce items. I actually ordered the frozen mixed vegetables and they substituted for this vegetable with asparagus. I would have rather had the frozen mixed vegetables, so I'm going to take a look for those at that third store that I have to go to. But we can have these as a side nonetheless. A big bag of fresh broccoli. I need broccoli for my meal prep as well as a dinner recipe. And then a red onion also for a dinner recipe. So that is the rest of this week's grocery haul with the exception of the couple of things I'm hoping to find at the third and final store. So let's go ahead and jump into this week's dinner menu as well as what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. So here is my meal plan for the week. This is the week of October 16th through the 22nd. I can't believe October is over. I feel like I say this every month, but it's blowing my mind. So today, Saturday, we are going out for dinner per usual. Sunday, I'm making slow cooker chicken pot pie. I'm really excited for this, especially as the weather has gotten cooler. You will see that recipe in Wednesdays, what I eat in a day. Monday is broccoli chicken noodle casserole. This also sounds so good and comforting. Tuesday is a leftover night. Wednesday, I'm making homemade mac and cheese, and then we'll pair that with some sort of protein. Thursday, Troy requested BLTs. Excuse me, Palmer. Can you not squeak your baby while I'm filming my groceries? Can you? Anyway, Thursday's BLTs, and then Friday, of course, is a leftover night to eat up everything left over from earlier in the week. And here is what you'll be seeing on Monday for meal prep. You're not gonna wanna miss this pumpkin fall inspired meal prep. For breakfast this next week, I'm making pumpkin overnight oats. It has been a minute since I've made overnight oats, so I'm pretty excited. Lunch is going to be chicken salad with broccoli and pasta. This is going to be a quick and simple lunch recipe because I'm pretty busy this next week. And then dessert, look at that, pumpkin cheesecake balls, providing I can find the last couple of ingredients that I need for this recipe. So stay tuned on Monday for all three recipes. Thank you for joining me for another weekly WW Grocery Haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing all the good stuff that I picked up this week. I am crossing my fingers to find the last few items that I need for meal prep at the fourth 
and final grocery store for the week. So if you enjoyed my haul, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. If you're new or you haven't yet subscribed, hit that subscribe button, click the bell next to it. I'd love to have you join my community. Don't forget to check out the description box for all three recipe eBooks, nutrition coaching, links, discounts to all my favorite things, and of course my Facebook group. Don't forget to come join us over there. Happy Saturday, friends, and I'll see you all in tomorrow's video.